Hey guys, it's Paul. I'm going to give you a quick introduction to uh, how to integrate uh, Acuity Scheduling and your Zoom meeting app. So that you can basically show somebody your schedule, let them pick a time where they want the meeting, uh, they sign up for the meeting, it automatically generates a Zoom meeting ID, and you can do it for classes as well. So we're going to get into it. Just before I start though, it's always good if you pause. Pause me now and tell me why you're here. Tell me what you're looking for. And tell me, tell me if there's something else that I can help with. I've got free Acuity training on my website and free Zoom training. Uh, these two great apps can work together. And of course, if you get any, if, if you get any um, value out of this video, it would be amazing if you subscribed. Thanks. Let's just talk pricing quickly. You need to be on the $15 a month emerging uh, Zoom pricing plan or above, where you get the advanced features, and you get here the uh, go to a meeting join me or zoom integration included right so you need to be on the 15 dollar a month at least plan right let's connect up this is my test account it's all fun uh, data in here i'm going to go here to integrations and i'm going to go down to if you say video conferencing up here or you just scroll down it's going to say zoom right i'm going to click setup connect to zoom so you obviously need to be logged into your zoom account uh, Acuity schedule the view manage your users view information uh, view all meetings view account information we're going to authorize it right and that just gives me a setting now to say which meeting which which appointment types do I want to create a zoom meeting for right so what I'm going to do is I will um, what should I do I will do it in these two these are just meetings and then in these classes as well what i'll do is i'll set up a class um, so what i'll do is i'll do it on a preset meeting appointment and then i will create a class and show you through right uh, enable join before host so if you want people to be able to turn up before you i think it's always a good idea um, use personal meeting id i would leave that unchecked if i was you what it means is your meeting personal id you've got a set meeting number a personal meeting number but if you use that i believe um each meeting will be the same id so what you'll find is other people will be turning up to your meeting so you want to leave that unchecked start meetings without video if you don't want the other person to have video options turn that off but i would take that top one and leave the other two off for now right so what's happening on my happy me interviews and the drink with paul youtube golf creator yeah, on these two, I'm going to create an automatic meeting, right? It's going to create a link, right? So let me go through now and go to my appointments, right? Where's uh, d -d 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 scheduling page link? So if I go here and somebody schedules my Happy Me introducing interview and says here, Tuesday at 2 p.m. And I'm going to do a test 1402. That's my first and last name, right? Test 1402, they can fill out their information as normal. Um, you wouldn't have all this form question. Uh, complete appointment. And there you go. There's your unique Zoom ID number. Here's your information. And you can add it to your calendar, add it to your Outlook. But now you have your Zoom ID ready. Okay. So the person, uh, that's me. Uh, installing it so the and you've almost got the person who's just signed up so here test 1402 has got this zoom id meeting right so that's what they would then just as the zoom's ready as the meeting's ready they're going to um, click and join that meeting okay so if i go to my zoom and check my zoom account and go to meetings uh what was it uh, da, 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 training class what did i say it was sorry um april the 14th at two o'clock right so april the 14th oh, i was right there i was hovering over it here is that meeting set up okay so now as the host of the meeting i can just go start the meeting if uh, if you want you can just click on that meeting and when you go to your schedule here's the meeting you will do here's the link as well right so you can you can open the meeting from inside your um 
acuity as well, right? So I'm not going to do that because you all know, I'm presuming you all know how to do a meeting, right? So here's the meeting ID, there's the code. Any information they signed up on would be the same, right? Now, let's do it again and prove that we get a different link because you don't want... What happened when I set it up before, I used to do these interviews um, and the same, Zoom email, the same Zoom meeting link went out. So what I had was one day I had two people the same day that overlapped a little bit and the second meeting, the person joined the first meeting. So here we go, Tuesday at 10.30. This time we're going to go test 14.04. Right, complete. Now, there's a different number, right? So here's the email come through to the new person when it comes through. It's not come through yet. Come on, here we go. So here we go, 7612195 is a different meeting to 732, right? And when you go back to your Zoom account and go to your meetings, here we go. Right, so here are the two different meetings. So that's just to show you how to quickly create a, a, a meeting with your Acuity, and it does do it in different, um, it does it in different I meeting IDs, right? So let's talk a class. We want to set up a class now where um, we we want to uh, have fifty people come in and pay us, right? And of, of course, you can do the payment on the last thing as well. Um, so appointment types. Here we go. New type of new type of group class, right? So here we're going to go um, online business training class, right? Whatever that is, right? What we're calling it. It's going to be. Uh, uh, it's going to be da -da -da -da, 100 minutes long, 90 minutes. Let's do 90, 190. I don't know why they want to do that. Block off time after if you want to spare 30 minutes after. Um, the price, here we go, 50, 50 pounds, right, if you've got a category, depends if you've got a category, I've got Happy Me Live, give it a colour, give it a picture, public, yes, this class, this is a class or group, and it's going to be 100 people, because you're allowed 100 people in your meeting, right, this is for meetings, it will not work on webinars, uh, clients must sign up for all, all times offered, that's if you've got a recurring class right so i'm going to create this appointment right and i'm going to offer this class uh doo -doo, next friday at uh 10 a.m right 10 a.m and that's it right so this class is set up to go out at 10 a.m next friday right now what i need to do though is go back here to integrations and set it up as Zoom. So see here, online business class is unchecked. You need to make sure that's ticked. So if you create a new class for a meeting, make sure that you come to the, the integration and tick it, right? Go back to your appointment types, go here to your direct link. So now we're gonna do 10 a.m. for an hour and a half, there's 100 spots left, sign up, test, 1407 this time and uh, this is the option to pay half pay now later that's how you set up however you set up your class uh, does it say where the price is pay now pay now 25 now or later it doesn't actually it must say it somewhere view product packages anyway redeem code I'm gonna put free because I've got a coupon code that's free okay so I'm gonna pay they would pay and you get, here we go. There's the Zoom meeting. So again, I go to Zoom meetings, refresh this. Uh, online, here we go, online business meeting, right? Ready to go, start the meeting. Now this time, I'm gonna go back to that, that link, and that link you can share wherever you want. So, um, oh, here we go. Um, you can go to this link here, look, and you can embed it in your scheduler, put a booking bar, put a booking thing, share it on Instagram, right? But let's go back to it, and now, oh yeah, there, it says there, 50 pound, look, that's where it says it. Sign up, this one's gonna be 1409, right? So what we want to do this time is make sure it's the same, um, 
meeting ID, right? Apply. Three. Here we go. Three three four two three one six nine eight. Right. So here's the first sign up at fourteen oh seven. Right. And we're waiting for the email any second to come through. So we're looking for this to be the same number. Three three four two three one six nine eight. And it is right. Exactly the same. So now in the class, if I go back, there's going to be, uh, now we're down to 98 spots, aren't we? So that's how to sell a class with Acuity. 98 spots left, right? And link it to your Zoom. Come through to your Zoom, right? When you're ready to start your class, you start the meeting, other people are already there because you allow people to turn up early and you accept them uh, in your meeting. Only problem I see with the meeting, the only problem I see with this for all classes is there would be nothing to stop someone forwarding that email to somebody else and then them clicking and letting them in. Now, 99% of people are not going to try to con you or diddle you out of money but it wouldn't be that hard to forward it on to a friend and they would click on that link uh, there's probably some workarounds around that but that's the only that's the only downside i see to it so guys i hope that i hope that explained uh, how to connect your acuity scheduling to your zoom uh, i hope it gave you some ideas of of how you can better manage your time better manage your your appointment availability and um uh, get even more out of your Zoom, your Zoom account and your Acuity account. If you come, if you've got any questions, you can come to my paulnigelson.com, log in and do a new question, or you can just directly contact me above. I'll ask, I'll ask the question. You, know, you can answer, ask the question in Zoom. I don't know if Acuity is there yet. Yeah, Acuity. Got any Acuity questions? Drop it in the Acuity um, category. Uh, in the free training. I'm about to launch some free Acuity training. There is already Zoom training there. Everybody's welcome. It's completely free, 100% free uh, to join. It's just a public forum, both training and the Q&A. Drop me any questions. Leave any comments below. I will help out as best I can. Thank you.